So I've hit the gravel now and I've got about another 10 k's of climbing up before I hit the saddle and then glide down into the Hope Valley. The downhill's been really good but over there I can see State Highway 6. Yuck! It's not so nice biking along this narrow road. Holy moly, that's a relief to be off that highway. Ugh. That's not fun. I basically stop, pull right over, conserve my energy, wait for it to be quiet, and then just like sprint narrow sections, and then pull over again, wait for it to be quiet, and then sprint the next section. Oh, I'm relieved to be off that highway now. Made it. It was quite a mess actually. Just going for a swim. Woohoo! Oh, it's good. I left you the keys, eh? Yeah, I got the keys. Okay. Oh, yeah. Enjoy. Uh, another gorgeous day to be on the bike. Left Murchison this morning. Bit of a later start, it's kind of like 10.30 now. And we're heading up the Matukituki Valley. Okay, it's uh, 12 k's into it and I've hit the gravel. Well, this is a pretty impressive little bridge and stream underneath. The gorgeous spot. Oh, that's lovely and refreshing. See ya! So we found a lovely place to stop and have a little afternoon swim. Chris is gonna continue on biking and I'm gonna just hang out here with the girls. Yay, 90k day, uh, and like 1100 meters of climbing or something stupid. Yeah, almost there, pretty tired. So today's section, we've got um, Linda here babysitting the kids, and Chris and I will get to do this section together. And we've got my dad, Alvin. Good morning. Who's gonna join us for the first section. All right, we've just swapped bikes. I'm on this town e-bike, and my dad's given a go on the gravel bike. Oh! See you, Alvin. Right, so we've left the lovely graded trail, and now this is where the section gets a lot harder. Um, we've been told to expect this trail to be muddy and boggy and also sections we're just going to have to walk. So I'm quite looking forward to it. 
it's gonna be good. Scanning. What do we got in here? Ho ho ho! Thank you. Downhill for a bit. Downhill, yeah. I think we're at that point. And so it must be crossing a gully or something. So down 150, back up the other side of 150. And then, yeah, only another 100 of climbing up to the hut. So we're a bit, a good kind of three hours into our ride. And we're still only at the, I don't know, 22k mark. So it's uh, slow going, this trail. Really slow going. Okay, so we've just got to the Big River Hut. This is the old historic hut. And we're gonna go up the hill here to the new modern day hut for our lunch break. This section's too narrow the pedal, so that's a walking one. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, look. <gasps> We're going into this interesting bit, Chris. Oh my god, this bit looks really cool. Biking along and come across this old school. Little classroom. Yeah, the history around here is pretty interesting. So from here we're meeting, or we're just going down this road a bit more and then we're going to meet my dad and he's going to shuttle us back to where the kids are staying. Sore wrists, sore knees. Sore everything. Yeah. But you just that saying good. that it was a lovely ride up there, <laughs> hey? Yeah. Hey? Yeah, it's something that makes you hurt is uh can be still quite good fun. <laughs> really good day. Not too hot for you? Yep, it was hot. Not too rough for you? It was very rough. Not too strenuous? <laughs> It was all of it. It was hard. It was, you had to concentrate. It was gorgeous. It was, there's not a single soul up there. It mm. was, um, yeah, it was just fantastic. Real Thanks. good. Good work. Uh, up there with the best ones? Yeah. <laughs>